Welcome back to another episode of Funked Up Gaming. I'm Levi. I'm Dakota. And we're playing Tales of Berseria. Oh, dang. Look how short them shorts are. <laughs> so, um, at the end of the last episode, you know, I'm sure... There's a blob. There's a blob. Because I know lots of people, like, watch all the Slime, way to the end sorry. of the episode. Talking about you. Anyway, um, at the end of the last episode, my cat had, um, crawled into the desk, the bottom desk drawer of my desk. And, um, we didn't shut the drawer all the way because we're not evil monsters. But we'll, we'll say we shut it most of the way. And, um, the one thing my cat can't resist is canned wet food. He normally eats dry food, but he can't resist canned wet food. So, we decided to shut it most of the way and, um, tap on the lid of the can. <laughs> to which he suddenly flipped out. But couldn't get out. <laughs> he had a space press down. He's like, God, well, go get out. There's, go, oh, there's can. I gotta get out. It was hilarious. It was. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, to be fair, before, you know, anybody calls Pete on me and I lose Geo forever, um, he kind of dug his own grave there. Look at all this. Blobs out the ass. I'm going to say you need to see a doctor if you have blobs out the ass. Damn. Uh. Now you do have blobs up the ass. You should wear adult diapers. <laughs> <laughs> you should tell him about your favorite thing about working at unnamed retail store. Um, never you had to restock. Oh, <laughs> I was not a big fan. Okay, so I used to work at unnamed retail store. Which, I mean, the really true fans, we got lots of those, um, will know where that is, because I said it once. Anyway, the thing I hated doing, we, we had um truck every Friday, which is, they would give us our new stock every Friday to put on the shelves and stuff. And I used to have to do what we called, um, I gotta remember what we called. It was basically just gross. It was like, um... Instead of like a tote that had a whole bunch of little things in it, it'd be like, here Levi, have a case, oh, case goods. Um, have like, you know, 200 boxes of Kleenex. And just put them on the shelf. I'm like, okay, and I'd run through all the case goods. And um, of course, the thing that came with case goods were adult diapers. <laughs> and they always came in like, they, they never could come in a cardboard box. If they came in a cardboard box, I wouldn't care. But they always came in like plastic wrapping. And I would just, they would always just poof, inwards. And it, there was no mistaking what it was when he picked <laughs> it up. I couldn't even, like, tampons come in a box. I can pretend they're like, oh, look, vitamin C. I do, oh, I didn't even know. Oh, I, didn't, I could just pretend it's something else. But no. Adult diapers poof, squeeze in. You're like, oh, <laughs> dang it. I didn't want to touch freaking adult. Oh, that's great. Somebody's going to be pooping in these. I mean, my God. <laughs> And there was no mistake in just... <laughs> Couldn't even pretend it was something else. Lame sauce. So, there you go. Those are ghastlies. Tell me I'm wrong. Uh, I think they're almost closer to haunters. Haunters have legs. No, they don't. What has legs? Gengar. No. <laughs> <laughs> My mom wouldn't buy me a Game Boy, okay? It's the best I got. Yeah, they do look like haunters. Yeah. That's what I meant to say. <laughs> Forget about it what? If I were you. Loss, loss, loss. I mean, maybe Eisen wants his prize. Win, to win. Oh. Damn. We still haven't won all of them. We got twin sharks and lemons. Did do you oh. make it with twin shark and lemon? No, <laughs> it looks like it. <laughs> Scout ship setting okay, dude, I'm I'm not really paying attention, but you know when you like hit a scout ship setting sail, uh -huh. it sounded like they started up the motor. What? <laughs> 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 it's like what? <laughs> that ship has sails. What the hell is this bullshit? The speedboat. What are they decorative? <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine? <laughs> it's like, hoist the sail! 
Sir, we're not moving. Oh, the sails are just decorative. We'll start the engine here in a minute. What? <laughs> Damon! <laughs> Marking on the counter. Ding! <laughs> Damon! That sounds like Trump building. Ah! Ha! Building Good walls. One. Good one. Well, that's obviously the metaphor. Arturius is Trump. Trump Turius. <laughs> Artump. I like that one better. Artump. <laughs> He's gonna kill all the little brothers and make the make the Mexicans pay for it. <laughs> Take me anywhere. I can apparently walk. I knew that. I didn't. I don't know how I knew that, but I knew that. I think I was derping around. Oh, that's what I was doing. I was derping around. Um, <laughs> I think I was derping around. Oh, yeah, I was derping around. <laughs> you were like in the bathroom during the middle of one of the episodes. I was like, I want to play. So I just like ran around the city and did a whole bunch of nothing. <laughs> and that's what I determined you could walk. I'm like, I don't know why you would Pressing need to walk. RP, you need to RP walk? walk. Oh, my God. This is not that kind of game. <laughs> Dude, I miss, miss RP and WoW. Something that doesn't happen anymore. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's because WoW is too big. Like, you can, okay. go, you can go to Goldshire. No, no. Let me just, <laughs> let me just stop you right there. No on, Pornshire. On, on no. Moonguard. No, no Pornshire. Why not? Because, no. You don't want... Okay. Matt. I developed my entire character's backstory and like who he is and how he got there and all this stuff and that does not need to be corrupted by who wants to suck my big, you know, skeleton dong. Whoa! You, you know you want a gnome fuda with a horse cock. I have to think about what that means. <laughs> a known fuda? Gnome? Fuda. Yeah. Futanari. I, I, I get it. I know what a food is. Or the horse cock. So basically, a very <laughs> small woman with boobs and a horse dick. Yes. Okay. Well, that does it for another episode. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Some people get really weird in their... Uh... And this is why I don't RP in Pornshire. Not to mention the fact that it's alliance controlled. Hi, buddy. They don't like it if I go hang out there. They, they try to kill me. Especially the guards. They don't like me. And, um, for the horde. So. Even though you switch sides, gross. Anyway, we're, we are grossly off topic. Anyway, <laughs> I'm pretty sure no one RPs in WoW anymore because it, if you look at, you know, the ratio to population of people who play WoW versus the people who RP, it's very one-sided, right? Mm -hmm. So let's say you have a handful of RPers. Well, the more area you give them to hang out, the less they're going to want to, you know, spend that time close together. They're going to be like, well, you know, two of them are in Northrend, and two of them are in Pandaland, and, you know, is there a new landmass? Uh, the Broken Isles. Oh, I'm sorry. There's a whole new dimension. I forgot. Well, yeah, there's that, and then there's the Broken Isles, too. Oh, I fucked up. You got code. I fucked up. You fucked up. I bought a video game and didn't play it. What? I mean, don't get me wrong. There. Uh, damn, we're not paying attention. I. Yeah. Damn, fuck. Velvet, you gonna bitch back that little kid? Yeah. Fuck you, Pecker Snatch. Or if we're looking for a way up, we need to quit going down. Go ahead and quote me on that. <laughs> <laughs> if we need to go up, we need to quit going down. <laughs> anyway, um, no, I bought fucking um, Legion. Legion didn't play it. Damn it! You played it for a little bit. Yeah. Well. Yeah. I know. I think we got to maybe 101. We got to what? Level 101. That sounds right. But isn't there 10 levels in Legion? Yeah. One. One ten. God. Hell, I, I've unsubscribed. I'm just, what? You too? Hey, too, Brute? Yeah. I just haven't been playing it. I mean, 
Hey, you hey, like beat it though. You could probably even raid it and like beat whoever the boss is. No. Uh, I I did the first raid in Raid Finder, and the guild I was in. Like, oh my god, your DPS is awesome. Come raid with us, and I never did because their raid times were stupid. <laughs> Sundays and Tuesdays. Yeah, those aren't good days for you. So. And just so you know, we make a lot more money playing Tales Berseria than you ever did playing WoW. We made an entire 60 cents. Well, you have to take into account... Uh, Taxes? That's going to be rough. Well, not even that. How much <laughs> money I've spent on WoW. That's a good point. I've spent a lot of money on WoW, too. But probably not as much as you have. Because I've, I've bought, like, character transfers and... Of course, to be fair, I introduced you to WoW. You did? Yeah. I am so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Another one? Yep. Hi, buddy. I got a top hat. Yes. Who gets to wear it? Uh... Not him. Uh... We can try it, but you'll... Nope, I love it. Nope, put it back on. It's great. Yes. He kind of looks like Blind Slash. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that that happened today. Don't don't give him his head hair. I like his regular hair with it. I didn't even know what you're doing. You don't want to see his big red face? Nope. I don't. That makes it seem like, that gives him a reason to be blind. You know what I mean? Now it's just now he's just dumb. I love it. <laughs> love it. This is awesome. <laughs> I mean, hell, I mean, the main reason why I stopped playing WoW is because I played more Overwatch. Back on subject. Um, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Dakota and I used to be addicted. Addicted, I say, to Team Fortress 2 on the Xbox. Yeah. Oh my god. I almost lost... A relationship over Team Fortune, which in hindsight I probably should have just lost that relationship anyway. <laughs> but regardless, Dakota and I get this shit. So Dakota and I used to play Team Fortress 2 on the Xbox, which we just talked about. Yes. Um, you can't multiplayer Team Fortress 2. You can't like split screen no. Team Fortress 2 on the Xbox. You have to, it's one X one player per Xbox. So we put our TVs right next to each other in the living room <laughs> and sat on the couch and would play Team Fortress 2 for hours. Doing the same thing. Yeah. Cheating. No, <laughs> no. We used to play legit for a long time. Well, then we, then we learned how to cheat, and then we cheated all the well, time. Well, yeah, because we're trolls. But anyway, <laughs> but we're not getting... We haven't gotten that far yet. Anyway, quit, quit giving away the ending. Anyway, so... Uh, <laughs> anyway, comma. Um, we used to play Team Fortress 2... And I would always be engineer, and Dakota would be whatever the fuck he wanted. And the reason we did that, for example, if we were playing Two Fort, which for people who don't play Team Fortress Two, is capture the flag, and there's Dakota there's would two go. Forts. What? And there's two forts. That's right. That's why it's called <laughs> Two Fort. Um, so Dakota, I'm pretty sure you just lowered that water, but we're not going to go. I, there. I, I lowered some water. I didn't lower this water. Apparently. Well, that's bullshit. Tell it it's bullshit. Anyway. Um, I bet there's another one over here. Oh, I'm sure there is. Um, Dakota would go and get all the points. He would capture the flag and be awesome. And my job was to make sure we didn't lose. And I guarded our flag. Yes. Which was the intelligence. And, you know, say what you want about Dakota being awesome and, you know, getting all the points. Because he was. And he was real flashy. And he, you know, kicked total ass. But I was fucking good. <laughs> At defending the damn intelligence. I had it down to a science. <laughs> a fucking science, boy. About where exactly I would put my fucking turret. And how this would work. How was, I was an engineer of being an engineer. You know what I mean? Yeah. It was great. And I loved it. And then we got to play in fucking Dust Bowl. Which is its capture point. But, I mean, I got to the point where I would time myself. And how quickly I could set up turrets. And how quickly I could do this. And it, it all I loved every second of that. And then we learned how to cheat. <laughs> <laughs> and we we never cheated to win. Yeah, we didn't have to. We were good enough. We could win. It didn't matter. There were a couple people like, you know, five sided fistigon was pretty good. Yeah. Um. There, but there were a handful of people that were really good, and we couldn't beat. But um, hang on. 
Oh, we'll have to tell them about Heavy 130 on Steam, too. Oh, yeah, that's <laughs> So, anyway. Um, but we always did it just to troll people. And the way, the way you cheat in Team Fortress 2 is you can go under the level, under the ground. If you think about the level, there's the level in which you can run around and do the things you have to do. There's outside the level, which is in between the level and the skybox, and then there is the skybox. Period. And we would always hang out in between the level and the skybox. Depending on what level we were on, we were either under the ground, or we were in the sky. Yes. And we'd always build sentries, and we'd always wreck people's shit. And we love doing it under the ground because you can't shoot and kill the sentries when they're underneath the ground. Yeah. So we, you would just die. You'd just run out and just die. And get really pissed. And, and that's whenever I would be playing... Engineer as well. Oh yeah, because we just cover any entrance to get to where <laughs> it needs to be. It just... And I mean, I and then, lo and behold, I had that down to a science. How quickly I could, you know, cheat the game and shit like that. I mean, he'd be doing it on offense too. Oh yeah. I mean, I was. Oh my god. Like I'd go defend him while he did it, and then, and then we'd be under the ground, and all of a sudden everybody'd be pissed off. <laughs> <laughs> And to get this shit. This is a great camera so, angle, by the way. Do what? The camera angle I was in was oh. like it was like looking at her hair. Nice. That's helpful. Yes. It's like Dante's Inferno. No. Yeah. So anyway, um, we did it for a long time on our server. We'd start a game and we'd set class limits. Yeah. So like, you no. couldn't be the medic and Uber past us. Yeah, and you couldn't be a spy. And then we got to the point where we were good enough. We play other people's games and ruin their shit. Yeah, and then we finally got one upped. We would cheat. We would use the game's rules against it, and then there were people who would hack. Yeah, and tear up your game. They would like, they like logged into the server and froze your Xbox. It yeah. was unreal. I mean, how do you even tell on somebody for doing that? Like <laughs> they hacked. Well, great. Join the other, you know, ten thousand complaints about how they're hacking and stuff like that. No, no, like these people are like. Hacking. <laughs> yeah, yeah, everybody's hacking. I was like, no, 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 but really. Yeah. <laughs> They're like, for reals. <laughs> so, and then, um, I don't know, I guess what happened was, for a long time I had a Mac, and so we had Xboxes, and then you got a PC and you're like, dude, Team Fortress 2 for the PC is even better, there's levels, and you know, custom maps, and stuff, and I was like, so fine, so I built the PC, which is actually the PC we're playing on, <laughs> and, um, and we just never went back. I went back once. And I tried to cheat, and everybody knew about it already. I was like, oh. Yeah. So fine. One day, maybe, I'll tell you what, if we get enough comments on this video about cheating in Team Fortress 2, we will go and make a cheating on Team Fortress 2 video <laughs> for y'all. Just to show you how fun it is. Another thing we like to do was uh, make all engineer versions, or like all engineer 2 Fort. Oh, yeah. Like all Pyro 2 Fort and stuff like that? Uh, with all Engineer 2 Fort. Oh, God. I remember now. All Engineer 2 Fort. It was ridiculous. No one wins. It just goes on forever. Until Levi lets me be other stuff. Yeah, that's right. And then I would let Dakota be other stuff. Oh, yeah, I, I would be a demo man and... Or like a spy. And just sap everybody's shit and steal the intelligence and call it a day. <laughs> Doe. I remember that. It would I, be stalemated start... forever. What? Yeah. The Good job, fuck? buddy. I don't know what the hell you're supposed to be doing. I've been I, talking I about Team Fortress 2. <laughs> Sorry, I'm writing down the title of this episode. I'll do that if you're not careful. Why to go, dude? You know what else I'll do if I'm if you're not careful? What? Oops. <laughs> I forgot how to end the episode. Like that? I normally end the episode. No. <laughs> but I normally do something. Like, I'll ask a question. I was like, you know what else has pants? Oh, damn it. It's like, <laughs> oh, okay. So, um, you know what else I'll do if you're not careful? In the episode. Oh, dang. <laughs> yeah, I've had some booze. <laughs> that uh, was terribly, <laughs> terribly anticlimactic. <laughs> <laughs> so, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Because we like that sort of thing. Yes. Especially if you want to see us play, um... TF2 and cheat our balls off. And I guess today's question is um, if you can cheat cheat in Team Fortress 2 
Would you? <laughs> yeah, I, I could have come up with that. That better. question was great. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so um, we'll see you, guys, see you guys tomorrow. Love you guys. Bye, everyone. Bye. <laughs> Thank mm-hmm. you.